Well, what, it, what it's attempting to do is to uh, take away the proprietary nature of uh, networks that you see today and really allow customers the ability to separate the uh, infrastructure and the proprietary nature of an infrastructure and make it more open for customers to deploy faster, uh, more agile business applications that they need to run their businesses. I think the first thing is the ability to deploy uh, business applications for customers much faster than they were able to before. Mm -hmm. um, I think the ability to take complexity out of networks, make them more simple, allowing customers to redeploy some of the maintenance dollars that they typically mm -hmm. have in um, maintaining their existing environments to moving those to innovation and developing new applications and taking new applications to the business that they can use in more productive areas. It's all based on an open standards mm -hmm. and when you when you adopt open standards it allows you to bring a lot more innovation to your organization and to your environment than before. Uh, it eliminates the whole vendor lock-in scenario mm -hmm. and proprietary nature of a lot of existing networks today. Well, the great thing about um, HP is we already today deploy OpenFlow in all of our switches um, and all of our networking products today. So customers are starting to take and make decisions based on the OpenFlow standard and SDN capabilities. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm starting to see the adoption today already. Uh, more and more customers are asking for SDN-based networks. You're starting to see a lot more education you know, as a representative of what we're doing here right. at the University of Toronto today. So um, the, there's very heightened interest into it. Um, I would say for the last, uh, you know, 18, uh, 12 to 18 months, it's been getting more and more uh, prevalent in terms of uh, conversations that we're having with customers. And more and more people are buying and making decisions on their network investments based on the ability to deploy uh, software to find And networks. you're starting to see application developers develop applications today that ride on SDN-based networks. So I believe as more and more application developers come with more business intelligence and more business-based applications, you're going to see the adoption rate go faster. Well, first of all, I think we need to talk about it. I think we need to make sure that, first of all, we support OpenFlow in our products today, like HP is one of the few that, that does that. Um, so that is absolutely paramount. I think we got to get away from the idea that proprietary nature of networks and network devices mm -hmm. is, is just no longer acceptable. And so start to talk about OpenFlow, start to talk about software-defined networks, the benefits of it, and encourage developers, mm -hmm. application developers, to come out with more uh, applications that write on top of it.